Thanks for joining us. I'm Corporal Devin Pomachan. U.S. 7th Fleet Commander Vice Admiral Joseph Acoyne shared opening remarks as Shimoda celebrated its 78th Black Ship Festival alongside U.S. Navy sailors. More than 160 years ago, Commodore Matthew Perry and his fleet of U.S. black ships arrived at Japan and negotiated the first treaty between the U.S. and Japan. The Black Ship Festival in Shimoda, now in its 78th year, celebrates that historic time and its critical role in today's U.S.-Japan alliance. Today, the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force and the U.S. Navy enjoy the closest naval partnership of any in the world. We are more than just partners and allies. We have also become good friends. Note that there are both Japanese and American sailors mixed together here, working together, marching together, enjoying this Black Ship Festival together. Lance Corporal Jacob Colvin takes us to the opening ceremony of another long-lasting partnership in the Pacific, the 22nd iteration of Cooperation of Float Readiness and Training in Thailand. The two forces will work together on interoperability in a variety of different parts within this exercise. With the continuing growth of training complexity, the two forces will have to adapt and learn from each other. And after 22 years of Care Thailand, it's safe to say that this team accomplishes that pretty well. When we need to come together, whether it is for a humanitarian assistance or disaster relief effort, or for some uh, greater uh, challenge, that we already know each other and we understand how to operate together. The team is ready and willing to go through a broad range of amphibious warfare, maritime security, and search and rescue operations. Reporting from Satahip Naval Base Thailand, I'm Lance Corporal Jacob Colvin. That is it for this news break. Follow us at facebook.com slash AFM Pacific now for more news around the Pacific. Thanks for watching.